May I have the viewer mail, please? Bring in the letters. Here come the letters, ladies. What, what happened to the uh, what happened to the model? Well, it's Thanksgiving, we couldn't get one. Oh, well, I appreciate you pitching in. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> One of our staff members, you know the odd thing about that? We, we gave him the t-shirt, he had the hat. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, actual letters from actual viewers that we accumulate here in the uh, Late Show mail room, and it's time right now to start answering these letters. Here we go, dear Dave, letter number one. Uh, I've noticed that members of your band, oh, Paul, it's a letter about you and the band. Oh, yeah, I noticed that members of your band collect a variety of interesting things. What is it, Dave, that you collect? Uh, sincerely, Mark Diamond, Green Acres, uh, Washington. Boy, that was a TV show. Remember that show? Green Acres. Yeah, that was very entertaining. Green I laughed Acres, myself Washington. silly. Yeah, that was great fun. Uh, what is it that you, Dave, collect? Let's see. What do I collect? Uh, well, speeding tickets, I guess. <laughs> Yes, a Rudy. Yes, a Rudy. Yes, a Rudy, as the Pilgrims used to say. Uh, letter number two, dear Dave, the holidays are just around the corner, and I wondered what is your favorite dish. Sincerely, Christopher Smith, uh, Bakersfield, California. Ah, oh, that's easy, Christopher. <laughs> My favorite holiday dish just also happens to be one of our brand new sponsors. Watch this. This holiday season, try stovetop stuffing instead of potatoes. Hell, try it instead of a hairpiece. <laughs> like I'm back on hee haw. <clears throat> Letter number three Dear Dave, are you a superhero? Question Is Paul, your boy wonder sidekick, just uh, pondering? Uh, Tammy Campbell, Sparks, Nevada. Uh, no, 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 that's silly. I'm not a superhero, and, you know, Paul's my friend, and he works on the show, but he's not really my sidekick either. But it just so happens that Paul is starring in the biggest comedy action motion picture of the season. Very right, proud Paul? of it. Yeah, right. you Very. should be. Thank Let's take a look at Paul in that movie. Here we go. Somebody stop me! <laughs> You shoot that in your free time, Paul? <laughs> the work is what's important. Yeah, I know. Ladies and gentlemen, letter number four. Yes, a Rudy. Here we go. Dear Dave, my 71-year-old mother thinks that people on TV say the word ass too much on the air. Uh, cordially, your ass-kicking hillbilly friend, Betty Rodriguez, Fort Gay, West Virginia. Well, you know, uh, I, I think, you know, I think I would have to agree with Betty on this one. I think that I have noticed uh, an unusual number of the uses of the word ass on television anymore. And I just want to give you my pledge now, Betty. We here at The Late Show don't feel like we need to, don't really want to, use the word ass to stoop that low, you know, to get a cheap laugh. Ah, and we wait, just, wait, what? Wait. What's what the matter? What are you talking about? We don't use the word no, ass. No, we do. We use what? the word ass all when the time When do we use the here. word ass? No, it we do. Take a look at this. Take a look at this tape. We use the word Here's ass? Here's a little known fact about our next guest. I once kicked his ass. <laughs> It's your ass. It'll knock your ass across the room. Dick ass man. You've got one of Dave's slew cards stuck to your ass. We can kick your city's ass. Yeah. Huge ass. Big ass ham. Big, Big ass, ass ham. ham. Big ass ham. Big ass ham. Big ass. Big ass ham. Ass. 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 You are a sick. <laughs> okay. Okay. I might have been wrong. Ah. Close up the old CBS mailbag. Here we go. Letters. We get letters. We get letters. Letters. Letters.